So today I'm going to show you a recipe for a very easy and delicious seafood burrito. So the first thing we're going to do is go over our ingredients. Sometimes your ingredients will try to escape, so you just have to kind of be on your toes. So what you need is one tortilla, uh, you're going to need one fish, a manatee, and two octopuses. I highly recommend getting the organic octopus because you can see the difference. This here is our organic octopus and this one is a non-organic and you can see the quality difference between these two octopuses. So you definitely want to go through, go with the organic. So then the last ingredient is one very chubby and delicious baby. What we're going to do to start out is we're going to take our tortilla and lay out our tortilla just like that. And then what we do is we take our first ingredient, which is our nice chubby baby. This is a good baby, as you can see, because she's very, very chunky and delicious. So then you, you, put, you put the baby in the tortilla just like that, see? And now what you want to do is tenderize the baby a little bit. So you just kind of do that by rubbing your hands up and down like this. And sometimes it helps to just give the belly an extra pat like that. And if you still don't think it's tender enough, you can always kind of do this. <laughs> and that helps make it very, very tender. So you know when it's starting to get at the perfect uh, tenderness because it'll start to smile and laugh like that. Now you still gotta watch that baby because she might try to escape. So you just gotta kinda, this recipe keeps you on your toes. It's not a difficult recipe, it just is a uh, busy recipe. So once you have your baby all ready, then you want to take your octopus and you just put the octopuses right there. Just like that is perfect. Manatee, you may have trouble finding a manatee because this is actually an endangered species, but if you look at some farmer's markets, you can usually find fresh manatee there. So then you just put that there and you take your fish. You can see I've already cleaned this fish. So you just put that there and then you wrap it up and you just wrap up your burrito just like this and it should be all ready to go. And then you take your burrito and you eat it. <laughs> and that is how you make a delicious seafood burrito.